Hello, I'm Kev at Rimmer's Music. I'm going to show you this today. It's Tanglewood TWCE1. It's a cutaway electro classical guitar. So we've got nylon strings, as you can see, three nylon here, and then these three in nylon just wound in steel. I've restrung it. It's got the Dario EJ27N. Yes. And the guitar is in perfect condition. There's no dints, no dings, no little scratches, nothing. It's in really, really good condition. It's got three band EQ here, which very handily I push pull. So you can set your tone. I've just got the mid down a little bit there. And then just put them back in. So you're not knocking them as you're playing. Uh, built in tuner as well. That runs off a nine volt battery just in there. Let me see where the jack socket goes in. So, wood wise, what have we got? We've got cedar on the top. Got this lovely rosewood back and sides. And we've got a mahogany neck and a rosewood fretboard. That's a classic blend of woods, cedar, mahogany, uh, they will give a lot of richness to the sound and rosewood as well, the rosewood fretboard, known for its precision. It feels great, so I've lem oiled the uh, fretboard cleaned it all up. The nut width is 48 millimeters. So I have played wider, but it's not what you call a, a slim net classical. It's still got that width there. Yeah. So yeah, I'll play a little bit. A little bit of finger picking. Bit of a medley of some random stuff. Okay. through uh, an amp by the way as you can see by the jack plug it's the kinsman kaa 25 25 watt uh, kinsman amp really nice it's nice and compact it's got a vintage look nice uh, vintage brown look with the wood on the outside the wood paneling it's got bluetooth three band eq there's two types of chorus and two types of reverb i've got uh, the whole reverb and it's on about three. Just getting that nice little tail off there. Uh, quality amp, absolutely fantastic. I'll put the link uh, to buy the amp in the bio to this video as well. Okay, so I don't think it's forbidden anymore, is it?
It's a great guitar. It would be ideal for beginners. It's nice and light, comfortable. You're not having to press down too hard uh, to, to get the notes to ring. It'd be great in a studio. It sounds fantastic. But for live use as well, uh, most bands have got them songs where they would need a classical guitar for a certain part, an intro, or maybe a, an acoustic song in the set. This is such a good guitar. fingers I do prefer playing with the plectrum to be honest but I don't mind playing with fingers it's not to say you can't play with the plectrum with this of course you can if you did you're gonna get a nice bright uh, more sparkly kind of tone all right but so rich just playing with fingers So, click the link in the bio to this video, it'll take you over to the website. I've taken some pictures, there's a write-up about this whole guitar, all the spec. Add this to basket, and this very guitar, I've only got the one, could be yours. Alright, thanks a lot. I'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye.